This is a KGUN 9 on your side news update. The 30-year-old Oro Valley man accused of luring a Florida 13-year-old to come to Arizona to have sex with him is expected to be extradited today. Sheriffs out of Florida say Kevin Dock met the girl online in a role-playing room. Detectives posed as the girl and arranged to meet Dock at the Tucson Mall where he was arrested. Tucson police currently have an open investigation of Dock because of child porn that was found during a search of his home. Buena High School will be open as normal today after being evacuated because of a bomb threat last night. Cochise County officials posted on Facebook that no threat was found. A janitor found a bomb threat written on a bathroom wall at about 6 o'clock p.m. The football players and cheerleaders were on campus and evacuated. The Sierra Vista Unified School District says canines and local police searched that school. The school board is also expected to discuss changing the name of TUSD's Rodeo Days holiday to something that focuses on the old Pueblo's heritage. According to the board's agenda, a local group wants to change the February break to Old Pueblo Days because it opposes the word rodeo due to how the animals are treated. The Tucson Rodeo is honored with a parade, local events, and a break from school every year. All right, well, April's here for a look at our forecast. April, good morning. Good morning to you. We're going to start the day pretty nice out there. I do think that we'll see temps go down before they start to go up. But right now, we're still sitting at close to 80 degrees in Tucson, 79, and we've got 60s across Cochise and Santa Cruz County. We'll be in the low 80s by the time the kids head off to school, mostly sunny to partly cloudy during the day, only about a 10% chance for storms during the day. It's later into the evening and overnight hours that our storm chances start getting that boost. We'll go up to 40% overnight then a 50% all day Wednesday. As we move into the weekend, we get back down to about a 20 to 30% as those upper 90s return. Mark? April, thanks. For more news and weather updates, head to our website, kgun9.com, and follow us on social media.